Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. When did you get on here today with a tag? I was tagged by the adorable Lisa J from Lisa J Makeup. She started a tag called the Kindness Tag. The purpose of this tag is just to spread love to other content creators and to share other good channels with subscribers. So it's all about positivity and love and I absolutely wanted to be part of that. And I'm gonna talk about Lisa further down in this video. I will just say she's adorable. If you don't know her, go check her out. Thank you so much for tagging me in this, Lisa, and I'm going to link her video down below. I'm also going to take a page out of the Two Orchids book. They did this um, tag, and they would show a product that that channel had given them that they had gotten from that channel. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to show you a product that I've gotten from that channel if I've gotten a product from that channel. So anyway, I'm just gonna jump right into this. Okay, the first question. Um, who are some people who are good friends to you on YouTube? I have a lot of good friends on YouTube. So the people that I'm gonna include on this are people who we've taken our friendship outside of YouTube. These are gonna be people that I talk to daily. Like we don't miss a day. If we do not talk, it's like, hey, are you okay? But the first one is L. At Ellis for Living, you all mostly know her. If you don't, you need to run over to her channel. She does great affordable products. She started a use up movement. She has a use up Facebook page um, in the low buy. When you think of the use up in the low buy, I don't know anybody, at least in our community, that wouldn't say, yeah, Ellis for Living. She's synonymous with that in her Sunday chats. Before I had a channel, I found L Sunday chats, and that's when I subscribed because I wanted to start my week with that kind of positivity and, and being uplifted. L has given me hundreds of products, okay, at least a hundred products. The claim to fame has to be the Mona Lauren. This stops me from getting sick. If I feel like I'm getting sick, I take five in the morning and five at night. This has been in many videos. It was in my yearly favorites. I rarely say this, but I would go get you some on Amazon. I'm gonna link it. Okay, the next person is Mary Ellen. And Mary Ellen after 60, and the first time I saw Mary Ellen, she was sitting in front of her staircase in her cozy house in her jammies. And I was like, oh yeah, I want to be in her life. Before I turned 50, I was watching YouTube videos and I would put a headphone in and I would go to sleep with her in my ear, talking about Trent Noyan and how it turned back the clock. And so her product, Claim to Fame, with me... It's got to be the Trent Noyan. She's given me many products, but this is the main. It's done wonders for my eyelids. It's done great things for my skin. It just looks better. Okay, next, Dawn's Life Over 40. Dawn and I became friends when I'd been on YouTube for about three months. And I think we started about the same time and just immediately struck up a friendship. And she's one of the warmest, most genuine, caring people. I love Dawn's Get Ready With Me's. I love her hooded eye tutorials. I love her purse reviews. And some of the best products that she's given me, the Lancome Tint Adol, she sent that to me when she went natural and I fell in love with that. And then this Rose Hip and Cranberry Face Oil. I love this. It's just lovely. It has a very nice scent not very expensive, feels really good, it's a vitamin A oil, and I love this, and I love Dawn. And then fourth, JD, and JD was one of my very first friends I ever made on YouTube. I met her about a month in, and I think she's been with me since video one. JD is great with makeup, she's great with skincare, and she leans towards the natural as well. Sweet Southern Charm. And the product that she gave me, her claim to fame with me, is the Dr. Chart every Sunday. This is a, sun, a sunscreen and it makes my face glow like I put a primer on it. Does it make my makeup oxidize? And I love this. She also gave me the MAC Semi Sweet Times 9. Okay, the second question. Who inspires you with their artistry? Um, the first person that came to mind was Mandy Davis MUA. She's a makeup artist, I think out of Tennessee. Mandy has great products and I love to watch her tutorials. Her products are great, her makeup's great. She's given me a lot of products. Her latest really great product she gave me is the Tarte Tingling Treatment. It's a lactic and salicylic, nice and active, makes me nice and pink, knocks off that step of doing an actual acid that I put on my face. I just do this, you know, in place of my toner. Okay, next. Who inspired me to start my YouTube channel? One of those was Mary Ellen, and I've already told you how amazing Mary Ellen is. Melissa55. Melissa is warmth 
Southern charm and hospitality. You just want to hang out with her. And then you look at her skin and you want to know what she's doing. She's inspiring with her skin. She's inspiring with her strength, her warmth, and her main products that she gave me. One of those was Tretinoyan. I could not say specifically who gave me this because I was watching all three of these ladies. And Obagi. Obagi absolutely transformed my skin and took it from sunspots and freckles that I just thought I was born with to I would just look at it and go, that's mannequin skin. It took everything off of it. Now I can't use, sadly cannot use hydroquinone anymore, but I still have the cleanser, I still have the toner, and I will always, I would imagine, have the Exvoderm Forte. This is my baby from that line. I've been on this for over two years, my skin has never acclimated. So if I was gonna pick one product from the Obashi line, this would be it. And my third person I would say inspired my channel would be Angie Hot and Flashy. I was really researching the Trent Noyan and her research is just second to none. She's just, she's a scientist. And two products that she gave me, I think she gave me the Timeless Vitamin C. It was either her or Mary Ellen. And she gave me the CeraVe Facial Moisturizing Lotion. And I still love this. I still love both of these. Okay, next, who, ins who inspires me with their content and their quality? Two people immediately came to mind. Laugh Over 60 with Sandra and Little Poet. I'll start with Susan because I've been watching her the longest. Susan is an artist. Every time I watch one of her videos, yeah, I get good products, but I feel like I've watched a short movie, a film, and they always as my kids would say, they put me in my feels. She puts it out there. If she's going through it, the good, the bad, the hard, the sad, the happy, you're walking through life with her. She touches my heart. And my next person that I think of when I think of artistic is Life After 60, Sandra. Her videos, every video starts with some music, usually some nature shots very artistic, which is not surprising. She's very creative. She comes from the actual, the industry. I think she worked on Sesame Street for years. Her entire life is so interesting. You never know what story she's going to tell. I think it's her cousin that was friends with Grace Kelly. She has dated famous people, like legendary famous people. She worked on Sesame Street. It's like rubbing elbows with royalty, but she's really nice. <laughs> you will love Sandra. Okay, next, who makes me feel good when watching? This was hard. You all make me feel good when I watch you. If you make videos and I'm subscribed to you, you make me feel good. So I've just named just a couple and it hurts to leave anybody off of this. But first, Pages and Polish. She does, and I've said this before, a mean book talk. She does tea talks. She does Halloween vlogs. She does vlogmases. Some of my favorite series that she does on Halloween, she'll do her top scary movies and her top scary books. And at Christmas, she does her top Christmas stories. The products that I've gotten from Shannon, I'm sure that some of my Tarte palettes I have picked up because of Shannon. But the things that immediately come to mind that she's given me, books and shows. Haunting of Hill House, I think. And y'all, I can only watch part of it because it scared me, but it was so good. I love her literary side and I love her makeup side. It's the best of all worlds. Okay, next. Trish Oliver. And Trish, she just makes me feel good in general. Trish is one of the warmest, most adorable people I know. I will tell you what makes me laugh. That girl, she might could shop me under the table. Her hauls make me laugh because they're so gigantic. And we love a lot of the same products. She loves drugstore, she loves high-end, she's nice and balanced, she just loves it all. So yeah, Trish just makes me smile. She just makes me happy to watch her. Okay, next, the New Orleans Gardener. She is one of the warmest people you will ever come in contact with. And I just like to walk through her garden with her. And then sometimes she'll cook lunch or dinner with the vegetables from her garden. And she is just warmth. Okay, next, Dr. Danny Fisher. Dr. Danny is an actual doctor out of San Antonio. I believe she's a um, an anesthesiologist who gets so excited about makeup. I told her, I just wanna go have surgery and talk makeup with you while you put me to sleep. If you get excited about makeup, 
go visit Dr. Danny because she has got great products and you will smile the whole time you're watching her. And then Susan W. She's Southern goodness. Just warmth and hospitality and friendly and I just want to go hang out with her. She does some diet. She also does some makeup videos and she is fabulous. She makes me smile. She was the one that told me about the real good low carb high protein pizzas and they are delicious. They have a chicken and parmesan crust. They've been in several videos. I'll link those down below. Thank you Susan for the real good pizzas. Okay creators for luxury advice. These are people that before I watch I open Sephora and I open Nordstrom. And this is where I'm going to do some damage. First, Natalie. Natalie the Beauty Diva has given me so many products. The latest one has not even been on a video yet, and that is the Born to Run. Now, I've seen this on many people's channels, but I would say that she is the one that pushed me over this cliff because she loves it so much and she's done tutorials with it. And then the Guerlain Meteorites. They're on their way. They're not even here yet. Natalie is one of the warmest, most giving people. She lifts people up around her. She talks that anytime she has a product in her video that she's heard from you, she's gonna be shouting you out. She's a special person, that Natalie the Beauty Diva. And not only that, she has amazing luxury products and then she has some drugstore. She's down to earth too. Okay, next, Mel Thompson. Mel Thompson is a makeup artist and she worked at Nordstrom until recently. And I just get great products from her. She does great tutorials. She has great products. <laughs> She's given me some good ones. She gave me the Chanel Universal and she gave me the Diffuse Light. So um, yeah, Mel's given me countless good products. Okay, next for luxury, y'all, I'm new to this channel, but I gotta mention her because she set off maybe my most gigantic haul I've ever made last Saturday night. Tara Babies. Do y'all know her? I started watching her and went down a rabbit hole. I marathoned her. My husband was sitting in the recliner over here. I was laying on the bed. I can't believe he didn't. It's like there should have been smoke coming off my phone. He said, what are you doing? I was like, I just shopping a little. And she just has the most beautiful products. She, um, I believe she's from South Dakota and she works with horses and hauls some makeup. So anyway, Tara Babies. Yeah, she's going to be a new addiction of mine. I love her. Where do I go to get expert advice that's well researched? I'm going to start with Lisa J, the creator of this tag. Y'all, I learned so much from her. And right now she is doing a series on industry secrets, makeup artist secrets, Mac secrets from when she was a trainer. She was a trainer at Mac. I am learning so much about technique. She did a brush video recently, and the whole time I was like, I need a spiral. I need to be taking notes. Her claim to fame with me, and this is big, y'all. I had given up on Shape Tape. I had bought it twice. It was like, I can't use that. It was just thick. It wouldn't do right. And she did a tutorial using Shape Tape, and I was like, I'm going to do it. <laughs> I'm going to get it again. I bought it again, used her technique, and I have not been off of it since. That was over a year ago. And so, yeah, she gave me my Tarte Shape Tape. Okay, next for expert advice, Pen, Pen Smith Skincare. She's just a go-to. If you want to know something about procedures, the latest skincare ingredients. And let me tell you one thing I love about Pen. She works in a dermatologist's office, but she will come on and tell you, yeah, I think you can do just as good at home. And this is the instrument you can use. So I really appreciate that about her. One of the main products that she has given me is the L'Oreal Shine in 910. It's what I have on today. And she saw this and she said, I'm sending you something. I found a lipstick and you need it. Pen is a good friend and I absolutely look up to her for expert advice on skincare. And then lastly is I had to include Elle Leary Artistry. She changed my eyeshadow technique. I've been watching hooded eye tutorials for years and I saw this one hooded eye tutorial on Elle Leary Artistry. It's changed the way I do my eyeshadow. It has changed the products that I can use. I can use eyeshadows I used to can use. She knows a lot about skincare and she's a makeup artist. If I'm not mistaken, she's a makeup artist to the stars. Yeah, if you're looking for expert advice, you need to get over to all of these ladies. Okay, and then this last one, who makes me laugh? Y'all, I did not even have to think about this. Kate the Great. She makes me laugh 
every single video. This morning I was watching her and I was late to the gym because I did not want to turn her off and I didn't want to just be listening. I wanted to be watching. I know she has some good products. I haven't been with her long enough to shop with her yet, but it's only a matter of time because she also does makeup and skincare. And so I know she's going to sell me some stuff and she is a, she's a riot. And then Flower Bomb. Flower Bomb 31. I could have included her also on Creators for Luxury Advice. She has sold me probably a third of my products. And she is so funny. I will tell you, it's an irreverent sense of humor. I like that. The latest products that she's given me are the Too Faced um, Powder and the Urban Decay Optical Illusion. Y'all, I could seriously pull out 20 products that I've bought with Flower Bomb 31, and she makes me laugh the whole time I'm shopping. Okay, and that is the kindness tag. So anybody, please feel free to do this, and, it, and please know, if I watch you, I love you. This was a very hard video for me to do because I love so many people. Thank you again to Lisa J so much for tagging me in this. I'm going to link her video down below. And y'all go visit all of these channels. They will bless you. And down below, link some channels you want us to know about that just make your life better so that we can know them too. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please like and subscribe. Leave comments and questions down below, and I'll talk to y'all soon. Y'all have a good day. Bye.